A Benin High Court has ordered the Edo State Government to release details of the costs of Benin Water's uh, storm and control projects as prescribed by the Freedom of Information Act. The presiding judge, Justice Okungboa, while delivering judgment on the case, said the prayers filed by several pro-transparency groups under the Freedom of Information Act is in line with the provisions of the Act and ought to be obeyed. Justice Okungboa declared that those that filed the motion are entitled to the relief sought from the court. The construction work at the Gapina site, which is the area that uh, we are seeking clarification, began a few months ago. Today, much progress has been made, and the devast devastating flood has been significantly reduced. If you go to that community, uh, like we, what we are doing there is still a work in progress. But the, uh, the, what we have been able to achieve is that the impact the devastating impact of the flood has been significantly reduced, and by the time the project is completed, it will be 100% uh, eliminated. Also, we have intervened at Quinede, and of, of course at Akewan, uh, uh, Akewan Road. Uh, we also presently, we are also working at uh, Ibore and Ewu. Um, in addition to these first uh, sites that we have done, Right now, we are intervening at about nine sites. We are intervening at Urura. We are intervening at Gapiona. We are intervening at uh, the college. Um, we have Ogiso Sunde. Uh, we have Emu Ohodua. And there's a gully that is ravaging the uh, faculty. There's a faculty of I think, man, uh, architectural st environmental studies at Ambrosali University, we are also working in the university.